Welcome to Fantasy Island. Yeah? Right. Anyway, now, I can show this. Now, on my TV, it is actually a smart TV. Bear with me. Uh, how do I do this? Uh, here we go. Now, I don't actually have anything set up apart from HDMI 2 and HDM3, which is for my PS4. I don't have anything else set up at all. Yeah, got nothing else set up at all. Yeah? Anyways, so that's that little bit sorted out. So, because it's not actually even connected to the internet. So, anyways. Um, <coughs> now. Oh, yes. Let me just show something else, actually. Right there, if you look there... There's my PS4 on the left with the blue cable coming out. Now, I just got that back literally last... Well, uh, what day is it now? Saturday. Last Thursday. Um, which I can also show evidence of anyway. Because I was actually originally going to sell my PS4. Because I just didn't really use it that much but didn't realise that there was actually more games coming out for it. So I thought, oh, okay, I'll get it back and and uh, I'm going to start getting some new games. I thought they, they would have stopped making games for PS4 by now, to be fair. So, yeah, I got it back off my buyback. I was going to let it just go. Anyways... And tell a long story short. Now, where was it now? Where was it? I've got to do this now. Uh, which one was it? That one. That one. That one. That one. Uh, anything else? Hang on. Bear with me. Mm. Mm -hmm. Leave it alone, it's only the fox. Now, this is the beautiful thing about these trolls. They chat, like to chat shit about their so-called victims, a.k.a. survivors. Right? Now, here we go. Right, let's just bear with me a minute. Let's find my other one. Is that the one? Oh, yes. Here we go. Now... Uh-huh, there we go.
I'll miss this one. No, it's not them. Ah, there we go. There we go. But this isn't, to be fair, I've still got stuff in the, um, the um, pawn shop still anyway. So, anyways. Right, now. I actually got, I actually got my PlayStation 4 and all this that I'm about to show you back last Thursday. But this isn't all of it. I mean, I've got like over 13, 14 grand's worth of jewellery. Yes, a lot of it was left to me by my mum and was given to me through my mum's personal assistant and uh, solicitors and things like that. Well, pro will and probate. Anyways, because apparently I stole it from my mum like the day after she died. <laughs> no, I actually had to wait for about four or five days um, and then... Um, once the death certificate was printed out, um, I was instructed to go to my mum's will and probate. And everything was left to me. So, anyways. Um, yeah, this is actually what my mum... This is some of the stuff that my mum left for me. Now, this is actually a five and a half... No, four and a half ounce. Or four ounce, something like that. Um, 22 karat gold. It's Indian gold, and it's got all the real diamonds, rubies, stuff like that. It's about four or five ounces. You're talking, you're talking at least um, when I last had it originally valued. You're talking about just under, uh, just under two and a half thousand pound. But at CC, so I get over £1,800 for it on a buyback. But I have to pay so much for it. So, yeah. Um, that was that. Um, this is a uh, white gold, two and a half ounce, three ounce bar. There you go, three and a half ounce or three ounce white gold bar. Uh, that's what my late stepfather left for me many years ago. Uh, this is my mum's two ounce bear. Um, and it's white gold. Um, and that's 22 carat. Um, and you're talking probably in the regions of about £1,500, £1,600. I get about just over £800 on the thing. And I have to, that's just for that. And I have to pay about £840 back. Something like that, anyway. So that's that, anyway. Um, this was my... Uh, I think it's 18 karat gold my 18 pendant that my mum and my late stepfather, well, my late mum and dad bought for me many years ago, obviously, when I was 18. And that's all diamonds as well. I mean, that's that's worth about £140. Um, so, yeah. Um, this, this is a nine carat gold no, 18 karat gold um, pistol, pendant, um, that I, I, I think I'd get about 80 quid on that. I have to pay about £100 back to get it back. Um, it's actually called a blunder gap. Uh, and numerous rings, white gold, platinum and normal yellow gold. Um, that was about four or five hundred pound to get back. Um, oh, plus my real sister's, my late real sister's um, little um, 18 karat gold locket. 
18 karat gold locket. Um, but just to let everyone know that my go, uh, this GoFundMe thing is not in my name. See, I'm not that stupid. It's in my family's name. My step family's name. It's not in my name at all. So if you're going to try and look for it, don't bother because you won't find it. <laughs> so, yeah. Anyways. Um, oh, and just to let everybody know, it's gone up to about £600 now. So it's going good. It's going well. So... Um, but yeah, like I say, um, hello, bubbies. Yeah, like I say, um, so yeah, I like to just put that one to bed because these weirdos, you know what I mean? They like to stick their noses in where it's not wanted. So, um, but she's got a nice surprise coming her way as well. So, anyways, it is what it is. So, I'm putting that all to bed. So, like I say, thought I'd just let everybody be aware. So, but yeah, I'm not watching them at all. I just, I just get sent the links and I just send it straight onto the police. And I'm enjoying, I'm just chilling out, relaxing. Watching my film, well, whatever the fuck this is. What we do in the shadows or something, apparently. So, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm cool, man. Ain't got a thing to worry about. My hand is cool as a cucumber, boy. But I bet these trollers are going to have some sleepless nights. Ah. Anyways. Me. I'm chilling out. I'm relaxing. So, yeah. So yeah, poor old trolls, mate. They're gonna have a real rough ride this year. But it's not as though they weren't warned. It wasn't though they weren't got, they weren't warned. So so yeah. Life is good, life is good. And uh, I'm looking forward to it. I am looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to my day in that court where they're supposedly going to counterclaim me and I supposedly counterclaim them and they counterclaim me and I counterclaim them. <laughs> so, yeah, um... But so far, I think it's gone up to about £600 now. So, uh, yeah. So, all I'm going to say is, I love you all. Peace out. And I'll be back shortly. I know I will. Just to put these things to bed, you know. Because the moment these silly trolls say something, it goes... Di -di 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 and it, there you go, I'll get a message or an email. So it's like, oh, have I got to come back online and put this one to bed? And pfft, you know, it's like, because they've got nothing else better to do. But talk about me because they love me. They just, they don't want me for my mom. They want me for my body. They don't just want me for my mind, they want me for my body. <laughs> so, yes. So, like I say, I'm just letting these idiots sing like canaries. Another one stick their big honky-donk crooked noses in other people's business. 
So that's why I call them the Cronkadonks. So yeah, they're the ones that got the big noses that they like to fucking stick in other people's business. So yeah, the old Cronkadonks. So peace out guys and speak to you all soon.